we are really excited about this grant. And this grant mainly is about uh, combination delivery of uh, two anti-cancer drugs uh, and using a, nano a nanoparticle approach. So our lab has been working on this uh, nano uh, carriers for the past uh, one and a half years. And uh, we, uh, we would like to utilize this nano carrier to deliver two drugs at one time. And two, uh, these two drugs actually, one is uh, already clinically approved uh, named uh, paclitaxel, and the other drug is 17 AAG, uh, which is currently in clinical trial. The, the common property of these two drugs are uh, basically they are both very uh, lipophilic, meaning they, they don't easily dissolve in water. So when the patients receive these two drugs, actually uh, they have to take, uh, have to accept large volume of toxic organic solvent at the same time. So the idea of this grant is really to uh, utilize these nanoparticles but without including any organic solvent. So we can deliver these two drugs very precisely and uh, target to the tumor tissues. The benefit would be uh, one thing, you, uh, we, uh, uh, the, the organic toxic organic solvent will be eliminated. So the toxicity from the organic solvent will be erased. And the, the other uh, benefit, uh, probably more significant, is uh, we will be able to target these uh, anti-tumor agents more specifically to the tumor tissue versus uh, the, the uh, spontaneous di distribution to the healthy organs in the body. So in other words, uh, the, the toxicity of the drugs will be reduced and the efficacy of the drugs uh, are expected to increase with this approach. Um, the, actually, there are a lot of active research going on to uh, deliver cancer drugs at a better uh, precision, uh, meaning uh, we can deliver the drugs to the tumor tissues much more at much more, uh, higher rate uh, and a higher concentration than the uh, healthy organs. Uh, but uh, the, the novel uh, uh, approach we are taking here is we try to utilize the same a nanoparticle but deliver two drugs simultaneously. And this hasn't been done uh, extensively. And uh, we consider our research quite novel in this uh, re regard. So we get very excited about this uh, cell culture uh, results. So the next step actually we like to investigate these uh, nanocarriers, when the, both drugs are loaded in the mice cells, we like to study these mice cells and see whether uh, the, the tumor growth can be significantly suppressed when we use the uh, nanocarrier approach versus the free drug uh, when they uh, administered in the uh, organic cell. So we like to uh, have more uh, clinicians uh, look at our data and uh, get interested in our research. And the long-term goal we have always, we like to translate our research into clinic. And we like to, uh, uh, one day our approach will become some, some real uh, therapeutic uh, agents.